Wow, that haired guy was scary. I know, right? But the real daddy must be so excited. They're going to give birth to a king. I'm sure they were excited, but this baby didn't just have a regular dad. Yeah, his daddy was God. What? Do you mean like how sometimes grown-ups call God their father? No, it's different than that. I mean, this baby wasn't made the way most babies are made. Well, how are most babies made? That's a good question. I think there's a bird. Let's just stick to one thing for now. We were telling her about the baby king. loves me not he loves me he loves me not he loves me he loves Greetings, me Greetings, ah! favored one the lord is with you where did you come from do not be afraid i i was more startled than afraid but seriously where did you come from i just appeared what do you mean like i wasn't here and now i'm here how okay but where did you come from before just like a different realm this is getting seriously freaky. Don't be afraid, Mary. I'm here to give you a message. And behold, you will conceive in your womb and bear a son. You shall call his name Jesus. He will be great and will be called the Son of the Most High. And the Lord God will give to him the throne of his father David, and he will reign over the house of Jacob forever, and of his kingdom there will be no end. Okay, what? I have, I have so many questions. I mean, how, how is that even possible? Mm, I think I have that somewhere. Here it is. The Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the power of the Most High will overshadow you. Therefore, the child to be born will be called Holy, the Son of God. And behold, your relative Elizabeth in her old age has also conceived a son. And this is the sixth month with her, who is called barren, for nothing will be impossible with God. I don't understand it, but I'm ready to believe whatever God says. That was weird. Um, I have something to tell you. I think I'm gonna be pregnant. You're pregnant? No, I'm going to be. What are you saying? An angel came to me and told me I would become pregnant by the Holy Spirit. An angel? They said the child would be the son of God. Mary, what? are you sure? Of course I'm sure. How can that be possible? Nothing is impossible with God. The angels even said, that Elizabeth is pregnant also. Your cousin Elizabeth? But she's so old. And barren. This is a sign from God. We should celebrate. Mary, sit down and tell us everything. Oh Mary, this is wonderful. But what will Joseph say? I don't know. He's a good man. I want to think he'll understand. Mary, maybe it's best if you go away for a while, during the pregnancy. We know that this is a gift, but others, they might not understand. It will be hard for you. But where will I go? To your cousins. Elizabeth will understand. If she's pregnant as you say, then she will know what a miracle this childbirth is. It's so wonderful to see you. I have so much to tell you. Oh, Mary, blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit in your womb. How did you know? Well, as soon as you greeted me, the baby in my womb leapt for joy. Wow. I mean, the angel told me all this would happen, but it's still so crazy to see it in person. 
Mary, it's so wonderful that you are so ready to believe the words that have been spoken to you. Your faith is admirable. And look at you now, preparing to become the mother of my Lord. Thank you, Elizabeth. But please, let's catch up. How are you doing? I have pretty bad heartburn, and my back is always sore, and I can never get to sleep. But how about you? Oh, you know, the usual morning sickness, although it feels like all-day sickness. And I'm the opposite. All I do is sleep. I'm just so tired. Carrying a baby sure isn't easy work, is it? Definitely not. But although my body is aching, my soul rejoices in Christ my Savior. Well, Mary, you must be famished after such a long journey. Come, let's get you settled in. Do you have pickles and ice cream? Wow, I'm loving this story so far. I'm glad you like it, but I think it's time for me to go and have a nap. You guys are all getting naps, Lucky. Have a good nap, Owen. Let's pick this back up tomorrow. Bye!